Hey guys, it's Angel Walks here, and I'm actually thinking about starting a series where I show tutorials or tips on how to improve your stream. I feel like there's always people that are looking for tips or ways to improve their stream, and I kind of have a lot of knowledge in this space since I've been doing it for so long. So let me know in the comments if there's anything that you've seen me do or you've seen someone else do and you don't know how to do it, I could probably help. Let me know. So in today's video, we're going to be showing you how to use the Apple Watch to show your heart rate on stream. So the reason I have my heart rate on stream is because I feel like it adds another layer to the stream and the immersiveness. I feel like it just is another talking point for viewers. You know, the more talking points you have, I feel like it's a good thing. So let's get right into it. So I'm pretty sure as long as your Apple Watch can track your heart rate, this should be compatible. Personally, I have the Series 7 and it works for me just fine. So what you're gonna wanna do is download Stromno. This is actually like a paid app. It's like five or six bucks. There might be other alternatives, but this is the one that I use specifically. I feel like five bucks is fair. It's not too much to ask for. So once you have Stromno downloaded, you're gonna go ahead and go to their website. You're gonna make an account. On the website dashboard, you will see a login code that you can put into your watch so that it links the two. That way, your watch is sending all the information to the website, and then you can add it as a browser source. Just copy the URL from the Stromno website, paste it onto OBS, and you should be good to go. You can also mess with a few things. You can change the font, you can change the color, you can change the animation. And guys, this is how it looks. It's actually pretty accurate as well. It shows your heart rate climb and drop, and you guys can see that pretty well in this clip. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like. Let me know what you thought down below, and we'll see you next time.